Is Smoke. it rolling? We are. Smoking grass. Right. Uh. <laughs> Dale, you do things on a racetrack. I've seen you and the fans have seen you drive a car all out of shape. You'll put the car anywhere you want to put it. How did you develop that kind of confidence? What is, what is it about you that uh, will allow you to make those moves that other guys won't do? A lot of hard work and a lot of sacrifice. You grew, well, I grew up in the sport, grew up around it. Uh, my dad raced, you know, so I came from the hard, you know, the hard working side of the track type racing. You drive with a, I don't know, with a sincerity, you know, you're real, you're serious. Uh, Every, every time I've been to the racetrack, I'm serious about what I'm doing. Uh, it doesn't matter if it's a, a 50 lap or somewhere up in Maine or in Georgia or where, you know, if I'm, if I'm in a race, I'm serious about it. I want to win. I want to be able to try to be competitive and uh, put on a good show for the fans. I think the true race fan knows what Dale Earnhardt's up to, what he's doing. He's out there racing. He's serious about racing. He's serious about what he's doing. And, and he just gets in there and races hard. He doesn't get in there and tries, try to knock the guy in the wall and all this stuff. I got in the, the situation where it happened up at Br uh, Bristol and up at Mar up at Richmond with Daryl and and uh, you know that that deal at Ri uh, Bristol was a situation with a slow car we got in there on top of them and uh, it just happened but uh, you know everybody makes mistakes and that Richmond deal was my mistake and uh, but intentionally wrecking somebody I never went out and done it and I never want to I've been mad mad at a lot of people and if, if if I was wanting to wreck somebody, I, you know, I could have done it a bunch of times, and I've been mad enough to do it a bunch of times, but I've never done it. I've never, it's never crossed my mind to go out there and wreck somebody. If I ever went on the racetrack to wreck somebody, I don't, they'd have to have done something awful bad to me. Probably, you know, stuck a knife in my back or something, I don't know. Uh, I, we haven't really got many plot problems. Teresa and I are, are happy, and we're, we're bailing hay here and loading, getting things put away here, uh, getting hay took care of for Charlotte here. and. Uh, you know, uh, working on the farm over, getting the land took care of, uh, starting to build a shop. Just bought another a backhoe, uh, fixing to dig up the world over, I reckon. <laughs> <laughs> okay, great. Thanks, Dale.